Yo, what's going on guys? Rob and Greg from Keely Herbals and Theogen Aquarium. Today we're gonna give a shot to some uh, Blue Lotus uh, extract. So raw powdered extract straight down the hatch with some OJ Chase It. And uh, we're gonna get into a little bit about what the herb is after that uh, while we wait for its effects. So, there it is. Oh gosh. Oh, bitter. Wow. Holy guacamole. That was what's that? Four grabs. This tastes like I just poured salt in my mouth and then bitter. Definitely a saltiness to it. Yeah, it tastes almost like a seasoning. What does this say? Yeah, make this into like, I'm putting on some savory food. <laughs> that was uh, something for sure. Yeah. Um, we haven't done raw extract like this in a while, so maybe a house change, but we'll dive into a little bit about what Blue Lotus is. Um, it's a flower. It originally had a lot of um, history in Egypt. I guess it grew on like the Nile River. It's like a flower that people would uh, take and they would infuse it to their wine for um, more of an experience. So that's used in like uh, like ceremonies. People say it can be like psychoactive or something like that in the sense of like they can make it feel like more uplift and thought provoked. Like, Again, yeah, it's like a nighttime herbal thing, you know, commonly. I, you know, it's discussed often that the herbs are like kind of like relaxing, yeah, but also a little uplifting. That's what I've read. People say it can be like psychoactive or something like that, in the sense of like they can make it feel like more uplift and thought provoked, I guess. But I do know it kind of was like Greg said, a little bit more relaxing and sedating, more of an indica type of experience, you know. But it definitely is a good herb from what we've had prior. Yeah, a little cat meowing in the background was attention. All in all, I would say I'm definitely feeling it like going through my body a little bit. I just started noticing the yeah. effects probably a couple seconds ago. Yeah, I'd say too, it's like warming. I'm feeling like a physical sensation, like a warming sensation going through my body a little bit. Yeah, definitely hurt. for me, a uh, uh, physical and mental release, like a relax, like kind of like, um, yeah, I get that feeling sometimes with cannabis as well. I'm a bit tired, calm. I'm more like focused, calm. I don't feel overly tired. Like, I definitely feel like a little stimulated as well. This would be great like, if you're just like watching a movie, hanging out, or like, you know. Like, I could see like it being like cool, like cool tea for nighttime, you know. Overall, I'd say it's a um, pretty good herb. I'm saying the effects right now for me, nothing too strong. It could come on a little bit more later. If it does, I'll uh, report it. But I'd say for me, I'm feeling like four to five of strength. Um, it, maybe getting up through a six, so four to six in strength. I, I guess the nature of the effects not being super stimulative, it's kind of hard to gauge, but like, mm. I guess because it is somewhat relaxing, yeah, I would say somewhere near like five, five or six, you know? Yeah, I, I think it's coming out a little bit stronger now, where I feel a little bit more of that like stony feeling, and which is adding to the six. To kind of feel like in my head a little bit, it feel kind of like that halo effect, you know, like a little pressure on my head. Like, Kind of a little pushing down on my body. Yeah. Did you enjoy this experience? Yeah, same. You know, it's so this would be a nice positive, positive effect in my opinion. Yeah, and uh, I feel like it's in its full force right now. Like I said, like getting that stony feeling, grounded, rim brought down. You know, that feeling. Definitely slightly psych so enjoyably or psychoactive in my opinion because, like, I definitely noticed like uh, my creativity in my brain, like kind of like you know, like when I'm thinking, I'm picturing things a little more vividly. Like I, I noticed a little bit of that going on too so it is a good herb i'm enjoying it um i'm glad we're working with it now having the carts and the gummies because this is a very enjoyable herb that um you know a lot of people open so it's a flower that you know we should build 